You know what? Just go ahead and give me a fat Eden start. Oh! It happened. Eden start McGee. Hold on, finally. Eden, you pulled through! You gave me a poly! Hello, friend finder. Uh, I'll use it once. I got a little mind dude, he's cute. You know, this mind dude is actually fairly useful. You can use him to blow up a lot of things, uh, rock-wise. Not the donation machine, but other things you can do. Still trying to find a use for this dull razor. Dull razor is really stupid. Like, it's absurdly good, but you just need an item. Another soul heart, okay. Well, talk about lucky. Not another soul heart, and that one's really good. That's a size down, tears up. Okay, downpour, something's cooking here. In here, we got Tammy, which is good. Or Book of Secrets. Ah, that's alright. At least that one's Bookworm. I mean, they're both active items, and I would have preferred Dull Razor over both of them. So, I would say I made the correct decision there, luckily. There is a heart there for us, and there is a starter deck here on sale as well. Touch you. We actually got the Angel. It's pretty good. Nothing special. Does it? Doesn't it scale off your damage? Oh my god, I think it does. Aww, oh, I lost Bone Heart. What a bozo. Okay, well, that's okay. He's gonna die the moment he comes out of this. He's. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not living, buddy. Speedball's cool, and then we'll go. I mean, we completed that floor pretty nicely. Ah, uh, Locust is cool, and this is a mob's bracelet, which is fine. Voodoo's good, especially early on. Oh, do I? Oh, I'm gonna buy you. Ah, uh, but I'm curious as to what I do with it. Steam sale, we're gonna try and get that. Uh, I'm curious because we can mystery gift and then question mark card, and that might be insanely good. Or I could give away my dull razor and have a chance at maybe a reroll in the future. But I, I'm kind of accustomed, or I, I just kind of like the Dull Razor. Something about its sprite, it's like begging me not to leave, and I, I, can, I feel like I have to. So we're gonna go with this, gonna grab you, and we're gonna hope that we get 10 more sets, because that steam cell is really juicy. Stapler! Nice. That is crazy damage. Does Spear of Destiny scale with damage? I gotta look this up, because I feel like it is! That's... <laughs> That's not normal. Ah, we got two bombs back too. That was incredibly worth. We'll go go smoke, grab that key, and then go to the mirror dimension. Uh, moving box. Oh, oh my god. Yeah, I mean like... <laughs> I, <laughs> I should never be afraid when I have this kind of damage. Claude is cool. I don't think we're gonna get... Ugh, 11 more cents though. Marbles. Unless I blow up the Keeper, but then I'd lose Steam Sale, but then it would technically give me a item. I, hold on. I, I, I'm so dedicated to the potential of this moving box. Like this guy right here, right? Three cents. Oh my god. Okay, yeah, alright, we'll do that. We'll do that. So boom, missing. <laughs> no. And then that, which is a good item, but... Ah, Pedestals are pedestals and I want them, so we're gonna we're gonna take that. Let's grab the mystery gift, moving box, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. And then we'll we'll take this with us. And then well hopefully we get a reroll. So there's things to do here. Let's put this oh we could just carry it, cool. Let's take these two, and then we'll go. We'll go. We're gonna stars card right away. Is it a good item? It's whatever. We're gonna put our two items in here and then take Book of the Dead with us later. What's in here? It's great, that's good. I actually I needed money. Since I spent so much of it. We are low on bombs, but I am going to use one of them just to go here. Just because we have a moon card to go secret room for free. And get absolutely nothing. Open these three and get cursed eye. Ooh. Well, there's my boss. So we know where things end. That's good. I am blowing up. <laughs> I'm taking so much damage. Alright, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to big risk it, I think. I feel like there's enough charge rate for me to another one of these goddamn reverse cards. I think there's enough charges for me to grab the cursed eye. So I think that's what we're gonna go for. And I, I'm so confident in it, in fact, that I will spawn this judgment and spend all my money. That's a perk throw, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Plop it down, and now I have one, two, three, four, five items I can take from that I just need to go ahead and get four charges on, which it looks like the map will. And I got a per throw, okay, so a little bit of rigging going on. Simple as that, really. And then you know what I'm also going to do? I'm also going to take as much damage going in and out of the curse room as I can. Uh, and plop this here because I have keys and I hope that gives me items. Oh, oh, um, 
All right, wow, one, two, three, four, five, that's seven items, hold on. Boom, HP, sure, moving box ready, lusty blood, I'm... Take Gimpy, and I'll take this. Gimpy, I'm imagining maybe sharp plug comes somewhere and then I can do something crazy with that. We can check you out, I have to, I have to do this right away. I'm wasting too much charges. Okay, cool, uh, squeezy, whatever. We'll take it with us. Boom! Play-Doh? Anyone else get like massive dopamine from Play-Doh for no reason? Like it's not really that good, is it? I'd honestly say fruitcake is better, but something about Play-Doh. Hello, sure. Uh, it just makes me happy. If it's a good trinket, I'll go out of my way to smelt it because I have that smelt in the shop, but it's probably just like whatever. Don't swallow the prize. It's whatever. I'm not smelting that. I will use it for the rest of the floor and forget. I, never mind, I'm not doing that. Did I- did I gulp it? What happened? What? No! I can't- I can't- I can't aim. Guys, this is terrible. Uh, quarter's cool. Alright, typically I'd go to the mausoleum with this type of health. I wouldn't be too nervous. Uh, but with the recent things that have happened to me, uh, we're going down. Cause I gotta play with a Polyphemus Ouroboros. If you didn't know, by the way, Ouroboros he was supposed to be a game by Edmund, I believe, uh, that just didn't get released. I think it was supposed to be a sequel to Timefuck, another game he made which I played, which was awesome. It's unfortunate that game didn't come out, but you know, oh well. Oh, hey. You guys think I- mm, I don't know. Uh, I'm sorry, I guess it's like, uh, I don't know why you showed up twice actually. Whatever. One, two, three. Is there a way that I can like get rid of my uh, heart so I can take this and I saw moving box it? I feel like that's, that's as good as it's gonna get though. Today I, I learned that I hate this judgment with a passion. Thank God you paid out. Jesus. Oh, I'm mad. I have a plan here. A plan of action. There's a soul heart in that curse room. I'm gonna lose the eternal heart for this, but I don't think it's bad. What I'm going to do is this. Grab the heart in the treasure room, that way I stop taking the heart around with me. Moving box, grab all that stuff, and then take the soul hearts that I've left over. I can't- I'm- I'm- nah, I'm gonna lose it. We'll try and get one more item, and then we'll late- we'll late as long as possible, we'll wait as long as possible uh, to do this whole rig thing, and maybe it'll pan out for us. Cool. Uh, let's go down today, why not? We've been going up a lot, actually. Uh, Death's Touch, sure. There's a lard. That was not what I was expecting. I can... Uh, okay, cool, whatever. You know what? Let's go. Come on. Please. Oh! oh my god, I'm saved. I'm saved, I'm saved, I'm saved. There's an R key. I don't even know what I want to do here. There's a spin down, there's a... Oh god. H inner Child, I might just take because it's a life. This is Bookworm, right? This will help me get DPS in. I feel like the logical thing to do here is actually just the infinity so I can get the better items. I'm just gonna try this instead. This is gonna be a risk, but... Ah, uh, that's good. Da oh, whoa! I didn't even see it! Wait, that's way better than just good. What am I talking about? I'm gonna go ahead and take Death Certificate. Take like a Sacred Heart. Because Sacred Heart will be an HP up, it'll give me homing, it'll fix my Ouroboros issue. I need uh, damage, actually. I, I know it's so stupid, but I need damage. Okay, Soul Heart, perfect. And a Sacred Heart. Poof! Okay, we're saved. And the Eternal Heart is not protected by that Soul Heart. We can take this. These items are sick, don't get me wrong, but I think I can go for more. We need six rooms, and it looks like we have enough, which is why I went for this risk. There you go. Look, even if it is Ouroboros now, the homing kind of overrides it and I'm doing a little bit better in terms of uh, enemies that get up all in my face like, yo, what's up? Please have enough rolls. I want to roll this one more time so badly. It was a big risk to get rid of uh, Spin Down Die, so I hope it panned out. Okay, we are going to get one. Unless this big L room is somehow just like the dead end and there is no boss and it has no enemies in it, we'll be okay. Perfectly timed rerolls. Okay, cool. We'll take care of Blub Blub. Uh, don't lose the eternal heart, please. Thank you, Gimpy. Box, cool. Card, maybe? I see some comments saying like, uh, when will you ever take Epic Fetus? I don't know, when it becomes fun. Oh! Okay, 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 okay. Take the rune, because it gives us a rune on pickup, I believe. Nothing useful there. We'll take you, sure. And then a lot of these are just like, whatever. We'll take GB Bug, because that can rig. We'll take Rock Bottom, and then I'm gonna spam this. 
uh, and I heard everyone's eyes, but it's gonna be worth it, trust me. I just gotta get to the next floor and clear a couple rooms, and then it's gonna make a lot of sense in a bit. It's just gonna hurt right now, I'm sorry. Okay, I used it a ton. I gotta clear the floor. I gotta clear the next floor and get rid of this effect. Is it going away yet? Oh, it kind of is actually. Oh, 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 more or less. Oh, there you go. Okay, I can I can see what's going on at least. It's going away. It's going away. Uh, let's use D8 with a uh, rock bottom as much as we can. Range and speed. Cool. Thanks. It's at least probably watchable now. I try not to do this to you guys as much as I can because I don't like destroying you guys' uh, ears or sorry eyes. Another judgment, huh? <laughs> well, I mean, if you're gonna give it to me, then sure. I guess I could roll another secret room. Back to normal. There's a charged key. Hold on. Wait a second. You've interested me. That judgment we got earlier? Judgment. It is a coin beggar. Let's get the D6 ready. And send it. No, that's okay. It lives is gone. Our damage, insane. My build, nice. The devil room? It has a lump of coal and not Krampus's head. It's golden for some reason, as if that even does anything. Okay, come on. Oh! Yeah, I'll take a binge eater, absolutely. I will definitely go to the chest slash dark room, open all of the good items, and then accidentally pick up a breakfast. I'm waiting for that to happen. At least the run is uh, winnable. It is winnable. I have something. Oof. It was rough, man, midway through, but we pulled through. Mega chest. Well, you can't just drop a mega chest somewhere and not expect me to do it. Not with 18 keys, right? I think that's just spider baby right off the bat if I do it. I'll take a spider baby transformation, sure. Roll it, maybe? Magneto. I will take the HP up for safety and stats, and then we're gonna D8 ourselves a couple times because we haven't been doing that. D8 just changes the multiplier on your stats. It doesn't actually change your stats. So we're looking for a high multiplier in terms of damage. Uh, it looks like we did get a damage multiplier, but it looked kind of small. Guppy's tail. I mean, if you're just gonna give me Guppy. That's definitely what we want to see though, going into the dark room, so that's exciting. And at the end of the run, uh, just in case this Wheel of Fortune reverse really was a, a reroll for my entire build, I'll do it. You know, we'll see what we get. The amount of exploding deadly flies. Locust of War, basically an item at this point. It's gotten so much value. And it hasn't hurt me too much. It's hurt me a lot, but mainly in the flooded caves. Right now we're chilling. Oh, right. <laughs> Mid eater. Ocular, that's okay. Oh, I'm Guppy! Uh, I'm actually Guppy, wow. Cool. We'll take this for Guppy and then we'll roll these. I don't remember the last time I turned into Guppy, so that's fun. Eden's Blessing. Uh. That's okay. Lacrophigy actually wouldn't be bad here? Question mark? With Ouroboros? Would it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. That was really good. Very good pickup. We've basically just got like Crooked's body. You're a free item. We don't have to worry about having not enough health despite the person of the unknown because I have binge eater. Like for this item, I don't really care about. This is actually just better stat if we take the uh, HP in general and then immediately lose it. Bozo. Luck up's good. It'll help us out. Maybe with Guppy's tail combined, we'll get more chest. Looks like that's happening. Spelunky hat? I, I'll actually take this. That's just good. Roll these bad boys again. Tech. Oh my god, literally all of these items are so good. I might just do that. All my stats again, we got range, sure. Uh, yeah, I, I'll do it. I mean, it's 2 HP. I'm not too nervous. And now it looks pretty. Plus we have Play-Doh, remember? Lost Soul actually won't do anything for us, unfortunately. I love him, but he's not gonna pay off. We already have Bookworm, so that'll be our next reroll. And finally, it looks like at the very end of the run, we managed to pull something through, which is cool. We got a Rainbow Explodey run. Chad, we'll just roll this. Choco means that I can spam a lot. Wow, needless to say, I've never seen this. That looks cool. It's like pinball. <laughs> I'm playing in the McDonald's Play Place right now. That's what this build is. I have the McDonald's Play Place build. And I, needless to say, I like the synergy a ton. Finger actually scales off of your damage, so I can just point at people and they'll die. Another chest. Ooh! Can't wait for a black heart. <laughs> Found a chest, thanks Guppy's tail. Starter deck. Sure, I'll take it. The sun card. Well, at least we know we're full HP. Forever alone, I'll take this bad boy. And then, before going in here, I'm gonna Wheel of Fortune. And it looks like it was a reroll for the entire floor. I don't know what it did. <laughs> uh, okay, well, cool. It did something. Goodbye to the lamp. And that was a really fun run. Thanks for showing up, McDonald's. Not sponsored, by the way. Oh, not over! Hold on, let me kill Delirium real quick. Did I D100 myself? That seems like a little bit too crazy. I don't exactly have the most dispensable health. What I'll do about this, so all the D100 enthusiasts get out there, 
uh, if I manage to get low enough HP during the Delirium fight, I'll do it. I've never lost a crane game more. That's a lie. I've actually lost it so many times. But we have at least conjoined progress. And then two of these items will be our reroll pedestal for the rest of the floor. Plus, maybe this judgment. Be smart about it. I oh god. Guys, I wheel of fortune one more time, I think. And uh, I don't know what I came up with, but it looks cool. It's like mind blow. It's like 3D. It's definitely Tech X conjoined, I think, Tech 2 and Ouroboros. Looks like I kept Sacred Heart somehow, because I have a white thing. A white technology tier. And it looks like I still have homing, so I'm assuming it's Sacred Heart. Yeah. Well, I lost my ability to reroll. So, and I walked into Delirium by accident! Okay. I think I can still beat it. My damage is high. I need to just focus up. I have a Unicorn Stump on standby. Oh yeah, no, this is easy. Oh god. God, in between everything, I don't even know what I'm looking at, but I got it. He's face for me, he has no armor, he's done for. Wow, okay. Hey, that was a satisfying end. GG. Never sleep on moving box, ladies and gentlemen. That thing is utterly broken and should be nerfed. Please don't nerf it. Bye.